This is the Morning Swim Show Streamline for Friday, April 16th, 2010. I'm your host, Peter Bush, bringing you news from aquatic sports around the globe. Fabian Jalot dethroned Olympic and national champ Elaine Bernard in the final of the 100 freestyle today at the French Nationals. After four swimmers went under 49 seconds in yesterday's semifinal, Gilot was the only one to do it in the final. He touched at 48.52. Bernard was second with a 49.02. Bernard still has the fastest time of the world with his 48-3 from semifinals. Though he won the event, Gillot is in jeopardy of not even swimming the 100 free at the European Championships. French rules dictate that Gillot had to swim faster than 49-64 in the prelims to be eligible to swim the event. But Gillot only swam a 49-69. It's a quirky rule and we'll have to see if the French hold to it. Well, Camille Lafa won the women's 200 IM with a 210.48. She's now the third fastest in the event this year. She leapfrogged ahead of Emily Seabom. We're finally getting to see Federica Pellegrini in her first major competition of 2010. At the Italian Nationals today, Pellegrini posted a 404.30 in the 400 free. It's the fastest swim of the year. Her main Italian rival, Alicia Filippi, withdrew from the event after complaining of shoulder problems. Japan has not had an international medal contender in the freestyle events, but Takeshi Matsuda might have that potential. Matsuda won the 200 free at the Japanese Nationals with a 147 flat, the third fastest time of the year behind Francis Yannick Agnol and Korea's Taewon Park. Yoshihiro Akamura also had a great swim in that 200 free, 147.60. The duel in the 100 fly final between Takura Fuji and Masayuki Kishida was a great one. Masayuki was out fast at the 50, but Fuji got his hand on the wall first at the 100 with a 51.94. Kishida just four one hundredths of a second behind. Those are the second and third fastest swims of the year so far. Rosuke Irie coasted through the semis of the 200 backstroke with a 156.81. He's already been 155 this year, so we'll see what he puts up in the finals tomorrow. Roland Schumann and Gideon Lowe put up some fast times in the 50 free semifinal at the South African Nationals. Schumann qualified first for the final, 22.16 was his time, and Lowe was second with a 22.34. Factoring all the swims from France and Japan this week, Schumann's time, the eighth fastest in the world. Meanwhile, his countryman Cameron Vanderberg, the 50 brush world champ and world record holder, could only manage a 27.93 in the event today and put him barely into the top 10. And as usual, we got results from all these meets at SwimmingWorld.com. Well, Nick Darcy, the Australian 200 fly national champ who was barred from the 2008 Olympics and 2009 Worlds for assaulting a fellow swimmer, he suffered a major knee injury during a surfing incident, Darcy told the Australian media he won't be able to attend the national team camp in Canberra starting next week, but he does expect to be back at full strength in time to train for the Pan Pac Championships and the Commonwealth Games. The Australian training camp will feature 58 other swimmers attending the Pan Pacs in California this August and will conclude with the team attending the Grand Prix in Sydney on April 23rd. Finally today, six divers from the U.S. will go up against another strong Chinese contingent this weekend at the FINA Leaning Diving World Series in Mexico. Troy DeMay and Nick McCrory will be the top divers for the men, while Kelsey Bryant and Abby Johnson will represent the U.S. on the women's side. And that's it for the news today. I'm Peter Bush reminding you to keep your head down at the finish.